edges and the corners. Children, here we have some objects before us. You have to tell me the shape of every object and how many edges and corners this shape has. We have to complete this chart over here. This is a toothpaste carton. Tell me how many edges and corners are there in this shape? Madam, this shape is known as a cuboid. So it has 12 edges and 8 corners. Good! So we will write 12 edges and 8 corners against the first shape in the chart. This is an ice cream cone. So now tell me, what shape is it? How many edges and corners are there? Madam, this shape is known as a cone. It has got one edge and one corner. Correct. So from our table's second shape, we will write one edge and one corner. What does the third picture represent? How many edges and corners are there? Madam, this is a cylinder. It has got two edges but no corners. That's right. So we will write two edges and zero corners against the third shape in this chart. This is a ball. What shape does it have? How many edges and corners does it have? Madam, the ball is spherical in shape. It has no corners and no edges. Correct. So we will write zero edges and zero corners against the fourth shape in this chart. All of you have guessed the answers correctly. Identify the sliding objects and the rolling objects. Children, have a look at these pictures and we will try to find out which of the objects in the pictures will slide down and which ones will roll down. Look at this first picture. In this picture, which objects do you see? A ball and a dice. Correct. The ball is spherical, so it will roll. And the dice is a cuboid. It has got flat surfaces, so it will slide. Look at the second picture. Which object do you see in it? What shape is it? The second picture shows a tyre. It is circular in shape. Correct. The tyre has no flat surface, so it will roll. What do you see in this third picture? How will you describe its shape? There are two coins in this picture. They are cylindrical in shape. That's right. They will slide on their flat surfaces and roll on their curved surfaces. So today we have learnt about cuboid, cylinder, cone and sphere, these geometrical shapes.